All right, guys, remember this yellow uh, 2005 Mustang GTR concept car? I love this thing. Well, I finally found one of the other colors that it was available in. I got this uh, red and black one here. So let's uh, test drive it really quick. Interesting. All right, so I don't have the official remote for this, so it's a little hard steering this thing. Wait. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little off screen right now. Yeah, so a few years back, you know, I I showed you guys this uh, one tenth scale RC car, two thousand five Mustang GTR concept Mustang, and that's all I showed you. But what I didn't tell you guys is they made this in two additional colors. Uh, they have this one predominantly red with these black rally stripes, and then they have another one that's predominantly black. And I believe it had like gold stripes on it or something. Um, to be fair though, whenever I think of the uh, the concept uh, Mustang GTR, I've only seen it in this uh, yellow or I don't know if you consider it orange. I think it's either Valencia orange or Grabber orange, I forgot. But this is the color I've seen it in. Uh, but I, I've been trying to look, you know, track down the other two colors available in the RC form. So I was very happy when I when I found this bad boy. But yeah, um, back in, what, 1964, that's when the Mustang was born. So 40 years later, they made this, I don't know, this commemorative uh, Mustang GTR concept car, which is supposed to predate the, the 2005 Mustangs. And this concept car is, is, it was made for, for street racing, basically. So look at, let's look at some of the outrageous designs on this, on this car. And some of it's pretty accurate to the, uh, the full-scale version. But the most distinctive features, in my opinion, are these, um, these stainless steel uh, exhaust tips on, on both sides here. They kind of protrude out like that. And it's, it's a different color than the rest of the body, so it really sticks out. Um, they also block out the, uh, the, the, rear, uh, the rear windows back here, which are usually open on the Mustangs. And then you got this big uh, composite spoiler wing on the very back. Now on the uh, on the yellow version, it has this uh, carbon fiber hood, and I'm not sure why this one doesn't have a carbon fiber hood. Because I'd, I'd rather have a carbon fiber hood than than this, unless this is made, made of carbon fiber. I don't know. That that's in terms of the real thing. Um, giant outrageous uh, fender flares here, and then you get this uh, differential cooler. Uh, blocked by this aluminum grill, which is just plastic on the RC model. So I believe this one is the red one is 27 megahertz frequency. I believe the black one is too, but the the yellow one here, or I don't know, Grabber Orange or Valencia Orange. This one runs on 49 megahertz frequency. Uh, both of these are really beautiful. I I, I do prefer this uh, yellow one here, but this one's very cool too. Whoever sold this to me, he took really good care of it. Uh, same with this one. Like whoever these previous owners were, they took really good care of these um, RC car models. But yeah, one tenth scale. So I can do a quick, uh, quick scan of the uh, the wheelbase here, in case you guys want to know. I know it's been a while since I made a video on the GTR. So it's about nine and a half inches long for the wheelbase. The uh, length of the body. This would be a rough measurement. It looks like sixteen and. 16 and 3 8 inches long, roughly. Let's look at the width. The width, let's get at the narrowest point here. This is very rough here. It's about 7 inches wide. That, that's a very rough estimate. I don't want to take the time to actually measure measure, and keep measuring. That's kind of annoying. 
But yeah, this is a, a beautiful car, I think. A lot of people don't like it because, you know, it looks kind of like a ricer car with all these add-ons, especially this big composite spoiler on the back. But, you know, I, I dig it. You know, it, it gives the Mustang a, a different look here.